to do what they thought was once impossible. Hi, my name is Gilbert Patino, and I'm here to help you, to motivate you, to push you, to show you that it can be done, and nothing is going to stop me. Let's go. Yo, what's up, man? It's been a minute. It's been a minute, man. I was fighting this cough. Um, I had this real bad cold. And, uh, well, and then my kids, they got sick too. So, anyways, um, let's talk, man. Let's talk. Today, we we're talking about a few things. We're talking about uh, one thing that I do want to talk about is diabetes. I want to talk about high blood pressure. I want to talk about health in general. Um, I've... I've Got away from those videos, but I do want to talk about that because recently my brother was in the hospital. Actually, this past Sunday. <coughs> so I'm talking about <coughs> that cough just don't leave. But, um, <coughs> and you know what? I was doing fine. All of a sudden it's going to start. But uh, <coughs> he was in the hospital, man. And, and um, his A1C was at 10, which is the highest, very high. And his diabetes, um, my brother had a stroke. And it's, it's, it's scary, man, because, you know, at his age, he's 64, so at his age, it's very scary. But it's, it's scary for everyone because, um, you know, it's, it's just very dangerous. I've had friends pass away from having strokes. And I've had friends that are, that are still learning how to cope, still learning how to walk, still learning how to, you know, their face will never be the same, you know. <clears throat> but, um. You know, I'm live right now on uh, Facebook and I'm live on uh, um, face, Facebook and Insta uh, TikTok. So if you want to check me out on TikTok, I'm at, at Keto Coach. And on Facebook, I'm at Gilbert Patino. Or you can go to my um, Keto page, um, Keto is Life. Well, my video has always been about to help people. My podcast has always been about to help people. Whether it's with your health, your finances, building your credit. Um, showing you how to be an entrepreneur, uh, just a lot of things my show's about. So if you're new to my show, make sure you put one. If you're watching my show at a later time, put two. But so getting back to diabetes, <clears throat> what happens is people become diabetics because <clears throat> not because <clears throat> excuse me, <I'm clears throat> this continues. I'm about to get off, but not only because of sugar, but because of everything they do turns to sugar, you know, like bread turns to sugar, sweet bread turns to sugar, uh, pasta turns to sugar. So a lot of times you hear people that say, you know what, I don't eat sugar, so there's no reason why I should be diabetic. There's no reason why I should have high sugar. But again, it's not about that. <clears throat> Usually it's because you're eating foods that are turning to sugar. So even though you don't have a sweet tooth and you're not eating nothing sweet, that don't mean that you don't you can't become diabetic. And the way people become diabetics is because they're not they're not taking care of their self. They're not taking care of their health. You know, they're not eating right, you know. And then there's more that comes with it. There's you got high blood pressure. So a lot of times it's it's having a dirty liver. So when they tell you you have a fatty liver, that's the start of it. You know, once you got to clean your liver out, you know, and I show people how to clean their I show people how to clean their liver out, you know, by um apple cider vinegar, MCT oil. MCT oil is very wonderful because it cleans out your liver, you know, and a lot of people don't know that. They don't know that. You know, matter of fact, I, I told my brother, I said, hey, man, you know what? There's, you cannot, there's nothing you can eat right now. Like you could eat whatever, but you need to delete sugar out your life. Now, I don't get it because the doctors went into his office and they said, Mr. Chapa, they said, hey, you know what? Um, you're going to eat this way and eat this. and But it's they're giving you wheat bread. They're giving you this, giving that. And it's not solving the problem. It's still bad for you. But, of course, a doctor would never take care of the disease. They take care of symptoms. And that right there is coming from Dr. Jason Fung, which is an amazing doctor that shows you how to do intermittent fasting. And that's what I do. So I do 20 hours every day of intermittent fasting. And it's wonderful. And um, so anyway, so 
for people out there that are that that do have diabetes that are facing type two diabetes, having type two diabetes is a good thing because you don't have type one. When a person has type one, they're not no longer making insulin, and it's, it could be very drastic, and it's bad because no matter what, they're not making no insulin. So you're going to be diabetic for the rest of your life. When you're type two. You can defeat it <clears throat> like I did. But you got to understand something. Being diabetic is like, like, like doing something, like being, um, having a bad habit, like being a smoker and you're smoking and smoking. Or let's say an alcoholic. So you're drinking and drinking and drinking. The, mid, the, the minute an alcoholic stops drinking, he's no longer an alcoholic. The minute he starts drinking, he's back to being an alcoholic. That's the same thing with deleting sugar out your life. Yeah, you have doctors say, you know what? It's chronic. There's no way you can get rid of diabetes. That's a big lie. That's the, the biggest lie, the biggest myth I ever heard. Because I'm a proven fact. I beat type 2 diabetes. I beat high blood pressure. I remember taking them pills every day. I beat anxiety i beat depression you know i even beat asthma and asthma hits me still it's not really asthma but it's the weather when the, I'm, i live in texas so the weather's terrible you know it's more it's more like um um just during the time i guess when fall or something I'm not, it's just it's terrible for me but i'm no longer sick i have energy i have like energy to the roof you know so it's it's very awesome that I have this. Hey, what's up, Mike? It's very awesome that I have this energy, you know, that that um that I, I no longer have to worry about being sick. I no longer have to worry about having anxiety and depression and everything. Because that all comes from what you eat, <clears throat> believe it or not, you know. And so my brother. It hurt. It hurt because my brother, you know, he's got out of the hospital. So I know what he's feeling. I, I went through it. So now he's feeling like, man, you know what? I can't eat this. I can't eat that. What am I going to do? I love to eat this. How am I going to eat this if I can't eat that? Well, it's simple. And what I mean by simple is I made, I got it right here. I made this cookbook. And the reason why I made this cookbook was to get it to people that were having problems with not knowing what to eat when they were trying to drop weight. And I had to make something that was going to be delicious, something that people were going to enjoy. And the main thing about still enjoying dinners and enjoying food and breakfast or whatever you want to enjoy is knowing how to substitute. The key is to substituting. The other thing is knowing what the keto lifestyle is about. Knowing what the low carb lifestyle is about. Knowing whatever you want to do, what it's about. And how to conquer it. How to be able to execute. Because that's what we're trying to do at the end. We're trying to execute whatever we're trying to do. So I made this book right here. I don't know. I sold like maybe 300 units thanks to TikTok. Appreciate everybody on TikTok. They bought 300 units the first week. And I still sell units. It's an Amazon. It's an Amazon. You go to Amazon right now, you'll see it right there. I think it's probably number one still selling. The truth key to his life. And it's an Amazon. The whole book is in color. It's an amazing book. It shows you how to make cream cheese pancakes that are, oh my God, delicious. French toast. It shows you how to make Chinese food, Indian food, all kinds of food, soul food. You name it, and it shows you how to make it. And the reason why it shows you all that, because these are foods that I enjoyed, but I knew I could no longer have them the way that I used to have them. So I've been doing the keto lifestyle for over five and a half years already. It's been a journey. I lost 98 pounds and I've kept them off. 
I have gained a little bit weight, right? Because the body just going to gain weight, but no weight where I'll get back to where I was at. Not even close to that. Nothing. I'm still in size 34. You know, I think the last time I weighed myself, I was probably at 220, not even 220, like 215, 213, somewhere in there. And, um, and I stay there and I stay there and, and I'm good because my main thing was not because I thought I was big. My main thing was because of my health, you know, but enough about me. I use me a lot because I know me. I know, you know, my journey. I know what I went through and stuff like that. But I want to use some people that I helped out. You know, I helped a lot of people out, you know, with their health, you know, <clears throat> and some I helped them. And unfortunately, they went back to their bad habits and they're no longer here. You know, uh, let them rest in peace. But for some, you know, if they would have kept on doing what I told them, who knows? You know, who knows? You know, I'm not God. I don't I don't know when when it's your time. But I know that you don't want to rush it. And, I, and, I, and I'm here and I hope my brother's watching my show. Matter of fact, I'm going to tag him on it and let him see it. And I know you don't have it on here. You don't have the, you know, the diabetic stuff or a keto, what I'm talking about. And because I'm telling you, I do shows for everything else. And I didn't have time to set up my, my deal and everything. But, you know, I, I do a lot of things, man. Um, I, I, I buy houses. We flip them. Um, we, we, you know, we do that. I help people with their credit. You know, one thing about credit is it, people don't hit you to fix your credit into income tax. So I do that too. I, I do taxes, but once income tax season comes in, people will start hitting me up. People that I already hit up, people that I try to help out very, with very low cost. I try to help them out. And they were already, oh my God, I want to change my, I need to fix my credit, I need to fix my husband's credit and everything. But the minute you tell them, hey, well, you know what? You have to pay $149 and that'll be for you and your husband. That's it. That's, they, they, they vanish, you know, that's too much for them. But yet they could spend that at a, at, a, at, a, at a restaurant because let's be honest, that's what you pay to eat, you know? And so I, um, people's priorities are wrong they're very wrong they 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 say i want to i want a bigger house i want the, i want a different car I'm, i want to drive a different car i'm tired of paying rent i want to own my own mortgage i want to have my own house i want to invest i want to do this but they don't do nothing about it you know and i know we're probably jumping over subject to subject to subject but i'm just you know hey if i think about it i'm gonna tell you right now my show is not set up my show is live we are live so whatever happens right now happens and shout out to randy shout out to uh um nana um i don't know that's not a joke but shout out to all them man appreciate all y'all uh joining me and shout out to everybody on on facebook joining me right now and if i can help you reach out to me man you know um i always get my telephone number out my telephone number is 832-947-4997 easy number 832-947-4997. Call us today. And um, so what I do is I help people, man. I help people. A lot of times people say, man, you know what? I'm going to do this as a hobby. If it's a hobby, you should do it as profit. You should be getting paid for it. Whatever you do, you should get paid for it. And you should do what you love and love what you do that's the that's the last thing you want to do that's what you want to do do what you love and love what you do <clears throat> so a lot of you don't know my story you know and i, I don't know your story you know we all got a story everyone has a story and the problem sometimes is we don't like our story. We don't like where our story is going. And we don't understand like, hey, you know what? I plan to be this, but something else happens. Well, sometimes God changes your story. That story wasn't for you. Maybe there was a reason why that story wasn't for you. So you could change your story. You could change. I'm here to tell you, you could change your story. No matter what you were doing, no matter what you thought you were set out to do, you could change your story. 
you know, and no one can stop you. The beauty is no one can stop you. You could be anything you want to be, anything, anything, and no one can stop you, you know, and now everything you could find, like if you want to learn about playing a guitar, if you want to learn about playing, if you want to learn how this, this, that, whatever you want to learn about, it's there. You know, I'm a little older, so I didn't have that kind of, we didn't have the computers and and everything like that. You know, digital didn't exist. I grew up in 71. I'll be 52 in January. Don't look, I look good for my age, you know, because I take care of myself and I eat right. Um. So the thing about it is that now you have everything there. If you want to be a producer, guess what? You can be a producer. Learn on YouTube. Learn on TikTok. Learn on Facebook. Learn by the reels. Learn by other people that are telling you, you know. So and whatever you want to do, it's there. There's no excuses. Sometimes people, they work somewhere and they're like, you know what, man? I, I don't like working here. I hate my job. And they'll stay at that job when they don't have to. I tell everybody, you know what you're supposed to do at a job? You're supposed to be a sponge. You're supposed to go learn everything you need to learn and become that competition to them. If not the competition, open your own business. You know, my brother-in-law, my brother-in-law says, hey, man, you know what? I want to do tattoos, man. He says, this is going to be my new hobby. I said, this ain't going to be your hobby. I want to invest some more money. So let's open a tattoo shop. Let's do this. You know, I told him, learn everything and we're going to open a tattoo shop. And I hope he's watching because sometimes people, they, they say stuff from here, but don't mean it from here. Sometimes people say stuff to make themselves feel good, but don't really want to put what they have to put into it. Now, I'm here to tell you nothing's easy. Nothing is easy in life. Nothing. You got to go for it. You got to go strong for it. You can't let nothing hold you back. You know, whatever you want to do, whatever it is you want to do, you got to do it. And don't have doubts. You know, sometimes you just got to jump in. You just got to jump in. It's not like I'm telling you to jump out of an airplane with a parachute that you might not know it might not open. I'm just telling you, sometimes you just got to jump in. You don't know. I had somebody last time say, man, free. I want to do this. I want to open a taco, taco place, bro. But I'm scared that it, it's just going to not do good. And I'm going to go back for my job. You know what? The minute you think you, you got to tell yourself you might fail. Tell yourself you're going to fail. Tell yourself if you have to tell yourself, I'm going to fail this year. But next year, I'll be back up. Whatever you have to tell yourself. When you can admit to yourself you might fail then, hey, you know what? You're already winning. You're going for what you know. The reason why people do not succeed in businesses is because they give up. Now, and don't tell me, hey, well, you know what, Free? It's because, you know, you got to have money to run a business. You got to have a lot of things to do run a business. But you could come across that money. You could make that money. You know, like right now, in heart, I'm a hustler. I hustled since I was a kid. You know, growing up in a, par a poor family, growing up in Denver Harbor, it wasn't easy. It, I was we were poor. My dad was disabled. My mom was the only one working. Sometimes we had to wait for every first of the month to be able to get something very nice because my dad, that's when he got paid. So I knew at a young age, hey, man, you know what? I got to go out and do my part. I started working at the age, I want to say I started working at the age of 13 or 12, knocking on people's doors for the Houston Chronicle. And, and, and I know that they probably don't do that now, but the thing is, there's ways to make money. I remember, and I won't throw my brother's business out there, but I remember, and, 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 and some of y'all know what I'm talking about, some of y'all don't know what I'm talking about, but I remember I used to just load up the matchboxes, that's it. That was my job. Load up the matchboxes, you know, and regardless of what I did, I worked hard and I did it right. You know, 
regardless if it's if, if, if it's legal or not legal. I don't, I, today, I don't condone nobody to do nothing illegal, you know, nothing at all. But if I told you that I didn't do nothing, you know, if I was perfect, I'm lying to you, you know. But what I'm getting at is these days, everything is in front of you. You have so much exposure in front of you. You can learn anything. You want to be a welder? Guess what? Go, to, go watch YouTube videos. Get, to, get into school. Learn. Become a welder. Whatever you want to do, you can do it. And no one is going to stop you. You know, the only one that stops you is you. You are the only one that stops you. No one stops you. No one can tell you, you know what? You can't do it. You cannot do it. They can tell you until they're blue in their face, but you're still going to do it. Don't let nobody take away what you believe in. Don't let nobody take away your beliefs. Don't let no one take away your energy. Don't let nobody take away your hungriness for it. A lot of times we got these friends that we keep around and they say, oh man, you know what? How are you going to do that? Oh man, you can't afford it. Oh man, you know what? We're from the hood. We can't do this. Oh man, you know what? We can't do this. You, can, you know what? Get that negative negativity out of your way. You know, sometimes them friends, I got a few friends that I let go quick. We talk in minutes. We talk in sometimes in seconds. And da, 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 boom, I got to go. Because I know if I keep them on the phone, they're going to be like, oh, dude, man, you know what? I hate my job. Oh, man, you know what happened, man? I was driving and this fool got in front of me and, and, and talking this and this and that. And they're negative about everything. Yeah, they're my friends, but I'm going to keep them in the distance. Because I don't want them to take that energy from me. Like, I don't want to hear the, oh, man, all oh, this. I want to hear it. I want to talk to somebody who says, hey, man, you know what, Free? We about to make some money. Offer, you know what? I just bought a big house, bro. Thank you for the advice you gave me or anything. But I don't. I want somebody that's positive. I don't want to hear negative. <laughs> you heard her. I don't want to hear negative stuff. Siri, nobody's talking to Siri. Did you just hear her? She said one moment. That's crazy. But anyway, uh, shout out to Garrett. Shout out to y'all. Appreciate y'all. Uh, still joining me. But um. So, guys, man, if you go to my Facebook, you go to Gilbert Patino. So, Gilbert and G-I-L-B-E-R-T and in Patino, P-A-T-I-N-O. And you can see the video live and you can see the my my um, my information. You can see everything. You can see you get more over here, you know. Um, And so, I do a lot of things to help people with their businesses, you know. Whether you need a uh, an LLC, you know, which is very good. LLC can make you really good money. And can help you a lot. You pay yourself different with LLCs, you know. <clears throat> Excuse me. Man, I'm sorry about that. I've been, and that's the reason why I haven't did no live videos because I've been under the weather, man. This um, this cough, man, this is the last thing <coughs> that don't want to leave, you know. <coughs> Embarrassing, man. But anyway, so um, you know <coughs> where I was at is that. You could do anything you want in life. Anything. Don't let nobody take your joy from you. So if you need your credit fix, hit me up. I'll help you. I'll, I'll, I'll give you tips. You know, you know whatever. <coughs> Damn. <coughs> oh, God. <Damn. coughs> and I'm already talking about health. I sound like I've been smoking cigarettes. I don't smoke. I don't even smoke that no more. Um, anyway, guys, um, for some of y'all that don't know me, I'm going to go ahead and share something with y'all real quick. I am a graphic artist, and I do do magnets. This is a magnet. It's a funny story behind this magnet. <coughs> 
you got my cue card right there. You can you can pull my cue card. Look. So look, check it out. Yeah, I got my cue card. So a funny story about this magnet. I did, I had I had bought a Mercedes not too long ago, and I was all excited. I was gonna put, my, put, my put these magnets on my Mercedes. I wasn't thinking, but my wife was. My wife was like, "It's not gonna stick." I said, "Girl, what are you talking about? It's not gonna stick." And we got a, we got a TikTok on that, but because I was doing it live, I was all happy and stuff. But again, the right the wife was right, and it didn't stick. Uh, I am gonna put it on my my SUV or one of them. Um, but if y'all need some magnets, or if you need business cards, or if you need anything, this is beautiful. Look, or if you need somebody to make your logo. You know, I can make you a logo, custom logos. I do everything, guys. So, this is a very awesome way to promote your business. And whatever you got, guys, whatever you're doing, if you're on, if you're on TikTok uh, or on Facebook and you got a business, I I'm willing to help you. I'm willing to uh, help you promote your business. Uh, I'll buy from you. I, I don't got a problem with buying from businesses. You know, that's how we do it. We network. It's, all, it's always about networking, you know? Um, you're listening to the unstoppable show a podcast that inspires listeners to do what they thought was once impossible hi my name is gilbert Petit. i hit the wrong button anyway that's my intro but so also man if you're in houston katy or the surrounding areas even in texas and you need an awesome dj hit me up i've been mixing and and emceeing for I started in 89. That should tell you something. I started in 89. And I mix anything and everything. And you can check out my videos, man. Go check out my videos. I got some on TikTok. I, I have some on Instagram. And I have some on Facebook. Um, my my DJ page on Facebook is Unstoppable DJs. Um, I, think, I think it's Unstoppable DJs, DJ Gilbert. That's what things what it says like that. But um so yeah, uh, guys, man, if you have, you have any questions, if you have any questions, go in and write them down, right? Not write them down, but you know, type them down right there. You know, uh, appreciate all y'all, man. Appreciate y'all just coming through, even if it's just for a couple of seconds. I appreciate y'all, man. It means a lot to me. And it's been a while, guys. It's been a while. I did a raffle, but I'm gonna be doing a raffle soon. I guess because you know it's about to be Christmas, so I'm gonna be doing a raffle soon. And no, you don't have to pay nothing or nothing like that. Um, it's going to be very simple, something very simple. I did last time I gave away some gift cards and I gave away a couple of air fryers, you know. And so <clears throat> I don't know what I'm going to be doing. But uh, yeah, please, man, please. If you're not if you're not my friend yet, go add me. Add me on TikTok and, and um, add Keto Coach uh, for, the, for everybody that's on TikTok. This is what you're this is what the, this is my screen right now. This is me right now. Um that's my code. I'm trying to it's pretty blurry. I'm trying to get it to like that. So anyway, yeah, it's, it's pretty blurry. But yeah, uh guys, man, I'm here to help y'all. And if you need a, if you need to talk to someone, man, cuz sometimes we just need somebody to talk to, you know? Sometimes we went through something. Sometimes we had some tragic stuff that happened to us and we can't no longer move. We're afraid to put ourselves out there, you know. I'm a certified life coach, you know. And everything I tell you, I back it up. Everything. I got certificates. I got. It. I can show you everything. You know, I can show you my hours. Whatever you want to look at, I got everything. And so I guess what I want to leave you at is... Um, is believe in yourself, man. Believe, believe in yourself believe you can i, I want to play something for y'all i want to play something for y'all right now check this out here we go hi this is gilbert Tino, unstoppable motivation believe you can you can do anything in life it's only a matter of you believing you can do it i guess what i'm trying to say you have to believe in yourself no one else is going to believe in you like you would believe in yourself Every day when you get up, the first thing you should say to yourself, I believe, I believe in me. There is nothing I cannot do. Claim what you want. Claim what kind of day you want to have. 
Claim what kind of success you want to have. Claim it in the name of your Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. It does not matter how many times you try, but you can do it. If you believe in you, you can fix it. It's problems you might face. Might be your weight, might be your health, might be your finances, and you can overcome all circumstances. But first you have to believe in you and believe you can. You were made with greatness. Nothing is impossible once you believe in yourself. So believe in you. If you want to play these um, motivational speak, that's me talking. I, I don't even can tell my voice, but I got into motiva motivational speaking when I heard Les Brown. Um, I need to get these on iTunes. I, I've been procrastinating. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I got so many things going on, but I do need to get these in, on iTunes, and I will, and I will. But yes, you have to believe in you you wake up and you're in charge of your day that's the best part you get what you want out of your day if you wake up negative if something bothers you like and you wake up negative your whole day is going to be negative if you wake up positive your whole day is going to be positive and how do you do that how do you do that you reprogram your brain you're in charge of your brain. Sometimes we do things and we keep on doing the same things because we are listening to our brain. When you should be controlling your brain, you should be in charge of your brain. And how do, what I mean by that is because sometimes people say, man, you know what? I can't eat this way. I can't do this. I need to have food. I can't do that. You need to tell yourself, you know what? We're going to do it this way. <clears throat> I fast every day, 20 hours every day. And if my stomach growls or if my mind tells me, my brain tells me, you know what? We have to eat. That looks good. I pull to the side and say, hey, hold up, brain. I run you. You don't run me. I run you. We're not going to eat. We've been doing too good. We're not going to do that. And that's what you do. You pull yourself to the side and say, I'm in charge. It's me. I control you. You don't control me. You know, and when you do that, you're going to realize a difference. You're going to realize you are in charge. You are in charge. You're going to start using part of your brain you never know exists. You know, you're going to be like, oh, my God. I just. How do you think I got so many businesses open right now? Because when I started dropping all this weight, when I started clearing my brain and uh, feeding my brain the right way and feeding my stomach the right way and, and, you know, doing things like that, my brain function was like amazing. It started doing stuff I thought it would never do. There was times where I couldn't even go to sleep. I was up so late thinking of a plan, reading books, reading all these powerful books and telling myself, you know what, we got to be over here on this date. We got to do this right now. We got to do this right now. So anyway, guys, man, I appreciate everybody. Uh, we're at 33 minutes. <coughs> Sometimes we go an hour, you know, but I appreciate everybody. Thank y'all so much. If y'all need to reach me, you can reach me at 832-947-4997. You can also reach me at 832-715-2557. You can reach me at UnstoppableTX at Yahoo.com. You can reach me at Unstoppable General Group at, <clears throat> was it, at Ymail. Uh, yeah, Ymail.com. Something like that. It's a Gmail. Gmail? Ymail. Anyway, we'll get back to that. But um, appreciate you guys, man. And remember, God made all of us, every one of us, with greatness. All we have to do is use it. That's all we have to do is use it. I hope y'all enjoy the show, man. I hope y'all learn from this show. Um, get ready for the next one. I'm going to be coming up soon. Sorry about the little coughing I had, you know, but I knew I had to come up here and do this. Uh, please share my video, guys. All I ask you is share my videos uh, for people that are near me. 
around Texas or, you know, just around Houston, Katy, wherever. If you know someone selling a house, man, I'll flip them. Let me know. And if I get the house and I close it, I will be giving you some money. Um, there's always ways to make money, guys. Always ways to make money. Appreciate you guys. Also, man, I let you know if you need your credit fix, if you need that credit boost, if you need your finances down, your taxes down, whatever you need, I can help you with that. All right, guys. On that note, take care of yourself. Be blessed. Until the next video, God bless. Bye-bye.